Hello. Happy Friday. Hope everyone's having a good night. There, ah! Oh! The, uh, the um, game capture picked it up immediately. That's a nice change. Means we can just load right into the game. I'm actually surprised we're only about 50% through it. Uh, I thought that for sure we had made more progress than that, but it probably doesn't help that I did so much of the game out of order, but that's fine. It's like... I, I'm kind of torn between trying to just, like, grind this boss, or if I should just give up and come back later. I'm gonna give it a couple attempts just to warm up. Just for fun. Luckily, I played it so recently that I, I kind of remember. Not like, well, like I wasn't good at this part before, but. That's fine. The first attempt is always a wash. We can get this guy. Alright, just move away from him. Dodge out of the way. Wait till he jumps. Oh, I'm out. Okay. close. Pyro! Thanks for the alert! Yeah, I'll catch you later. of firepower. Get out of the way. Oh, I, I thought I was far enough away. Figuring out when to charge the fire blast is... Oh, nice. It would be nice. It would be nice if there was like barely enough time to charge my fire while he was charged like in between rolls you know if I can hit him like each time that'd be nice but I really just have to get out of the way Snowballs. Okay. Ooh, I was doing so well. That was such a good streak. Oh, damn it, damn it. Get out of the way. He's taking some damage, if I'm careful.
Oh, man. I was doing okay there. I keep doing that. I'm always like, I'm gonna get him right on the first go. way. Stay out of his way. Stay out of his way. Did that poorly, but it's fine. At least I got some charges. Oh, I thought I was out of the way of that one. I think I am a little bit too underleveled for this area. Um, I at least need some increased speed or something. So let's come back. I'm really close to getting some more upgrades too. My question is, I don't know where I'm supposed to go <laughs> if this is not it. So, cause I found that because I was trying to figure out how to progress and I just like couldn't find it. So let's, let's go back to the beginning. We'll try to kill some fools, get some souls. Let's go to the Lost Cemetery. And maybe we'll try going like Southwest, Southeast, Southeast, this bottom, this bottom corner on this side. Excuse me. Maybe even try going like just down this way. I think last time we went up. I'm probably gonna go out of my way to do a little bit of extra monster hunting. Um, just cause I really want those extra souls. We'll just keep an eye out for any paths that I may have missed. That's a, that was a good opportunity for a, a hidden area, but nope. We could try going down this way. Ooh, that, I mean, that's somewhere I haven't been. So that's a good start. Let's just try going around here. Into that fireplace. This is probably the wrong way. Come at me. Oh, I forget what this door was all about. I guess I just can't get to it yet. Let's try... Bomb? Nope. Okay. Can't open that door yet. Um, this doesn't feel like the right direction. But maybe I should just stick with it. Let's just commit to it for a minute. A map in this game would go a long way. That is one thing I feel like I'm missing. Just didn't knock over the gravestone or the headstone. That's good. Oh, I bet I can get through this door now. Hell yeah. What's in here? 
give me them souls. And there was something back here, right? Oh. Yes, but I've already been there. And there wasn't anything else for me, I don't think. Okay. Oh, and then that just goes to the door that we came from. Okay. I get it. I get it. I didn't go anywhere. Come with me, little sprout. Can I not go across? Is this really the only way to go? I thought I'd be able to take a left somewhere. And go up here. Ooh, how do I get to that? Ooh, okay. Yeah, okay. Here's something new. Oh shit. Well, I can get that. Is this area only if you fall? I bet it is. Oh, there's another hidden door. Well, it's not really hidden. It's just broken. Oh, this is a challenge already to improve my bombs? Yes, please. Hello, sir. Ooh, weird. No! Don't dodge out of the way too far. Got it. Let's stick with fire. Fire is just better for me. That's fine. We'll retry. This is a really easy area to grind. It has a retry button. This also reminds me, I have to- actually, this guy can just kill me. I already took damage. I have to- there we go. Wanted to have Discord open. Plunged to my death. Okay. Out of the way- oh, god damn it. God damn it. I'm like trying to move things around, which is just a mistake. It's just. So he'll always go right to me after that uh, green freeze ray. I like the little feet for the buttons, too. It's really cute. Okay, so I want to just move. There we go. Oh, what? That's rude. When I have charge, I should just really stay away. Okay. Move, 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 move. Fuck. This, this guy's- this guy's tough. jumps all the way to you. It's really... It feels unnatural. It 
it's hard to tell what's going to be an attack and what's going to be a jump. I'm not sure how to dodge that. This guy's harder than I anticipated, I'll be honest. study the animations a little bit so I can tell what's coming. Tuning fork is really cute too. I like the sound it makes. Oh man, that has range. Oof. Felt like I was barely even making a dent in him. Try it again. Oh, gosh. you just have to really get the timing right on the dash. Man, I just feel like if he kills me on one of those blue bombs, it's gonna it's gonna feel really cheap. <laughs> not super consistent. Like, sometimes he fires it, like, right away, and other times he doesn't. Seamus, thank you for the lurk. You're modding right now? Sounds like fun. I hope that it doesn't give you too much trouble, and it does what you want. <laughs>
Sure, everything will go well? Hell yeah. I learned recently that uh, the 3DS has a lot more capability than I ever knew. Like, I'm, I'm not super well versed on modding and stuff for, like, consoles, anyways. Uh, no. But one of my coworkers, like, says he has emulators for, like, all different types of consoles on his 3DS. And I'm like, really? You're playing The Witcher 3 on your 3DS or something like that? I'm like, that can't run well. <laughs> We're getting close. Uh, I only have one health. Don't jinx it. Oh, jinxed it. Fuck. Ah, uh, the worst. I'm the worst. God damn it. That's bullshit. You can't dodge that. Just really small. Oh no. All right, we're in phase whatever. Good couple hits. That's fine. It's fine. Okay, okay, okay. Woo, that was close. Fuck, that was also very close. Just keep chipping him at chipping away at him. Oh my god. Dodged a fucking bullet. Ooh. No, no, shit. I was doing. 
doing so well. I was doing so well. I can't, I can't believe I fucked that up. Oh, pizza's in the oven? Hell yeah. I've got chili that uh, I just made before the stream. Sitting in the crock pot for tomorrow. So I'm gonna have to get up every like, I don't know, half hour or something. Oh, this is a bad start. This is terrible. I'm so discouraged after that last run. Uh. But yeah, I'm very excited to, to have chili tomorrow. I'm gonna to let it sit overnight. And... Did I find the second area? Not yet. Um, I t attempted that other boss a couple of times and was like, you know what? There are better things I can do with my time. I'll come back here when it makes sense to. I wanted to just power through it, you know, just just cause. Uh, but I actually do want to finish this game so that I can start my next game. I don't want to like rush the game, but I don't want to make it take unnecessarily long. Chili is amazing. I just. I love having a bunch of, like, lunches prepared in advance, or, like, if I'm feeling really lazy, just heat up dinner, you know, I basically don't have to cook for a week. But if anyone's ever looking for a chili recipe, I've got one. I've, I've definitely posted it in, uh... Uh, 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 in the uh, Discord before. But I will always share it again because I really like it. Love and support meal prep meals. Meal prepping is like, it's so underrated. Every time I meal prep, I thank myself later but I just somehow don't always make time for it, which is silly. No! That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I started pretty, pretty poorly on that run. Pyro, how was the rest of your stream? Also just painting there hasn't been a lot of active chatters the last couple nights you know i yeah i've noticed that a little bit across like multiple streams i think that people are just a little busy right now there's kind of a lot going on oh that's the worst damn it But yeah, it like it comes in waves, right? Oh, I've got a crazy story. So this is from a IRL friend who streams who will remain anonymous for the sake of the story. 
Um, I noticed that they had taken a break um, and weren't online as much. And I was like, hey, are you, are you like taking a formal break? Are you coming back to it soon or what's the deal? Um, they actually started receiving weird stalker messages to their work email address with like pictures and love notes and like all kinds of weird stuff. Uh, and because it went to work email, it suddenly became a security issue, you know? For, for work. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. I had, first, I had no idea that was going on. Second, I've, I've never actually heard of that happening from Twitch to someone I know. Like, I've heard stories about it happening to kind of like, I don't know, bigger streamers um, and stuff. Like, that's kind of normal. But... Very not okay. Yeah, what the weirdest part is that they had to track down the name, business, and email address for them. Right? It wasn't just like, here's the information in my bio, you can reach out to me if you want. Like, they did some hard digging. Super weird. Super, super weird. But yeah, I would be a little bit uncomfortable streaming as well. I would also take a break. I still think that pause attack is OP. There just isn't enough consistency on it to know when he's gonna, what he's gonna do. Because sometimes he doesn't do anything. Sometimes he launches at you and other times he throws a bomb. Like, okay, let's see, what's he gonna do? There's, like, not really any kind of consistency. All right, so I think he's half dead. I think that's the halfway mark. Shit. That's fine. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. to say that the more I play this, the more it kind of feels like <clears throat> a cross between, like, Hollow Knight and Dark Souls, but I also just, like, need to not compare things to Dark Souls <laughs> all the time, especially since I haven't even played it. I just get similar vibes from what I've seen, you know? See, like, you cannot dodge that. That is unfair. Because he just goes to wherever you are. If you can't move, you can't dodge. Feels cheap.
His spin around tack is. It's rough. Kind of part of why you want to play it. I mean, it works. It works very well. It feels really good to play. It's challenging, but in my opinion, it's not too challenging, you know? Because, like, what was that game that we played a few months ago? Um, Undungeon? That game was just too hard. Once it, like, opened up a little bit, it just got really, really difficult, and I didn't know how to progress. I got kind of bored. Um, because <clears throat> I didn't want to just grind. This, like... I can pretty much get any boss after 10 or 15 attempts, maybe. And since each fight is only like a minute, it doesn't feel that bad, actually. Can't dodge it. I wonder if it's because I'm spamming the, the like, magic on him while I'm like that. He's like, all right, let's go get him. Oh no, god damn. Don't remember that one. Will you believe me? It was it was cool. It was also on Game Pass, so I just like tried it out on a whim because I, I looked it up and it, I liked the art. Um, and the art was very good. The music was excellent. Like there was a lot of stuff about the game that I actually loved. Um, but yeah, I just it was too hard, and it was. I think it like had a difficulty setting, but you couldn't change it once you had started the game. So I, if I wanted to lower the difficulty and keep playing, I would have had to have started from the beginning, and I was just, like, not willing to do that. I got lucky on that dodge. also a Kickstarter game, which was kind of interesting, Undungeon. I haven't actually played that many indie games that were funded through Kickstarter. Lots of board games, but not video games. Um, I generally try to avoid using Kickstarter just because I I don't love the premise of it. Um, I don't like the idea that you're investing in something rather than you know just purchasing it. Uh, it gives artists like a way to get funding without having to go through a publisher, which is really cool. But it's just I don't know. I don't like the risk, and I don't like having to wait like three years. <laughs> For the project to ship. Um, which is also kind of frustrating because there's a, a board game that I really like, Everdell, that is currently doing a Kickstarter for a new expansion. And I really want to back it, but they've been like very, uh, back it as a late pledge, but they've been very um, quiet about updates and it's already really close to fulfillment and it's very clear that they're not going to fulfill until probably 2023 uh, but because they haven't like made any posts about it it makes me feel a little bit uneasy like I'm confident they'll follow through because they've launched the game and previous expansions through Kickstarter like they have a really good track record
but I don't know. I'm just kind of like waiting for some more updates and saving my money until, uh, there, there it is. Until the, uh, the late pledge is announced to close. Wait to throw money at it. A silent servant servant has been vanquished and their soul power added to yours. Your bomb spell uh, now no longer damages you, only foes. That's cool. Nice. I've definitely hurt myself on that before. Uh, cool. All right. That's some progress. Uh, I want to go back up. Oh, and I've got enough money for an upgrade now. That's awesome. I will get that. I will figure out how to get that. I like that when it's upgraded, it changes color. Get your pizza! Hell yeah. Enjoy. Okay, so I'm here. Now what? Something with this circle? Well, it would help if I didn't miss. Let's- you know what? I've been curious about these shapes for a while now. Let's see if I can do that jump and strike directly on it. Just- just for- just for kicks. Just for kicks. <gasps> oh, I was right. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I knew that there was some sort of teleport between those. Because we'd seen these in multiple places. Oh, that was really cool. Oh, I feel so st Oh, that's so exciting. So we've already been to the overgrown ruins. But I know I missed some stuff, so I guess we'll go back. <laughs> I forgot about the shark! <laughs> Oh, it's so goofy. It's so goofy, I love it. Okay, I'm gonna pause really quick. I'm gonna stir my chili. I'll be back in, uh, in just, just a minute, just two minutes. I'm back. Hello. Sorry about that. Had to go and make sure the chili wasn't exploding. It's, it's doing good. It's chilling. It's, those flavors are getting to know each other. Oh, no, let me out. No, 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 let me out. Oh, fuck. Damn it. <laughs> All right, we're going back. Silly, silly, silly me. What was I thinking? All right, better get out quick. Whew. Sharkhead waits for no one. Uh, all right. Let's find some breakable walls that we can now get through. Damn it. 
I've also got Horizon Forbidden West currently uh, installing. Which I'm very excited to play tomorrow. Hopefully tomorrow. Whenever I finish this game. That's when we'll play Horizon. Oh, god damn it. Just walked straight into it. Like a doofus. Oh, gosh, don't kill me. Look at you while you beat up zombies. Bridge, welcome in. Wait, Bridge, before you go into Lurky, can you tell me what direction I need to go to get to the area that I skipped? Because right now I'm kind of just running around and seeing what I missed, like, in this area, but I haven't found, like, the whole area that I haven't gone to yet. Because uh, I was in the Lost... Not the Lost Ruins, the Graveyard area. And, uh... I've gone south and I've gone north. So I'm not sure where the next spot is. Uh, I'm also... I'm missing something. How did I get up to that other level? Oh, right, there's this thing. We hit that and it comes across. We're looking for breakable walls and secrets uh, like that one. Oh, we have to get to it from right here. I see. Yeah, give me all those. Oh yeah, there was this whole area too. That was like the... the witches... area. I think I do want to go in here. Do I? Uh... Oh, well, I can get this guy out now. Hey! Little bird, save Grunt! Grunt be forever! Thank, little bird! Aw. I hope he's not in there next time we come back. Like, I hope he actually does leave. That that wasn't just, like, an oversight. So, like, here. These I really want to get to, but I don't know how to get there. Let's... Ooh. There's a bomb area. Maybe this? Yeah. Okay, wait. Oh, right, the bombs don't hurt us anymore anyways. Oh, and I do have a key, so I can unlock it. We found a corrupted antler. I wonder what creature this used to be attached to. Interesting. Oh god damn, why am I why am I messing up? There we go. I have to actually be careful because I haven't gone through a door in a while. I've gone by doors, but I haven't gone to a door. Gone through a door. I don't need to go that way.
I will consume that. checking. I also need to keep an eye out for those platforms that I can jump on. Oh yeah, how do I get up here? Maybe I have to destroy it? No. There's got to be a way, right? Huh. I don't know. Can I jump onto it from right here? <gasps> I can. Look at that. makes me feel so smart. I want to go back to the, like, palace garden, wherever the hell that is. got that one just by luck. I don't think we were supposed to be able to, but we did. I don't even know how you jump onto that one. Oh, it's from up there. Okay. This goes back in here. Oh, it's a different little entrance, though. Yes. I've done this, right? Where does this take me? Oh, it just takes me back. All right, well, fine. I wanted to come back here anyways. Let's get some upgrades. We have enough for at least one. Maybe even two. If we don't get lost. We have to go up? There it is. Welcome to the soul vault. to charge their melee attack and ranged attack faster and increase the speed at which melee attacks can be chained as well as their reach let's just put it all in all in magic let's just get like the beefiest the beefiest magic possible I guess we can go back to the Lost Cemetery. I want to find the... 
The estate of the Urn Witch. Yeah, I want the estate. I know there were some bomb areas that I couldn't do in here. Yeah, this is where I want to be. And there's like some holes in some of the fen in some of the fences here. I have to keep an eye out. Like here. I've, I, like, found one of those towards the very end of this area, and then I was just like, damn it. I don't want to go back through the whole place. But I kept it in the back of my mind. Oh, why'd I go down? What was I thinking? go. Where are we going? Oh, this is so nutty. Okay. Where does this one go? a little distracted, but you're back now? No worries. I hope your pizza is delicious. I discovered a really cool trick in this game for secret paths. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's super cool. I love little hidden surprises like that, especially if they're like not too important, you know? Like if they're super important, they're tedious, but if they're totally optional, which these ones are, they're just, they make you feel good when you find them. ghost. Where are we going? <laughs> we have gone across like the entire map. Oh. You found a sludge filled urn. Despite being almost black, the liquid somehow... Uh, emanates a strange glow. Weird. Very weird. And we're back at the beginning. What a nice little detour. I also saw this over here, which we can get to now. Oh man, we're getting so many souls. It's really nice. Get some much-needed upgrades. Um... And that might be, like, I feel like that was so much that I'm less interested in, in even, like, searching around now, because I feel like we got it all. Take a quick look, I suppose. Yeah, I don't see anything. I think it's good to just go back. I think we're fine. Oh, never mind. Found something. 
I stand corrected immediately. Man, the game is stuttering a lot. Just with the sound. Oh, I see something up there, too. <laughs> I love how much damage that does. It's so nice. Oh, maybe I didn't see anything. It was just this plaque. What? Come on. I think the final upgrade for uh, our magic is tw costs twelve hundred, so we can afford it now, which is nice. Oh yeah, and then up here there was something. couple of things that they like tease you with right up at the entrance yeah so we got like one side but we never got this side to get that thing so how do we get in there that's the question I would think it would be something like this. Oh my god, that's a that is a scary looking dude. Let's get him in a second. Grab that first. The Garden of Life. Alright, I guess we'll go fight that guy and then we'll explore this area because we haven't been over here at all yet. We only have three health, but hopefully we can make it work. Hello, sir. You're fast. Just like the other one, but you know. Oh, I'm doing more damage for sure with my magic. Woo, stay out of his way, stay out of his way. This guy won't be too hard to get if I don't fuck up. Oh man, so close, like one more hit. Yeah! Oh, nice. Did that- did I not really get anything for that, though? Alright, let's read this. The Garden of Life. Thank you, Pyro. Oh, I'm out of... 
things that I can hit with. Good. I don't know what lighting these is doing, if anything. I assume they just all have to be lit. Two fireballs wasn't enough to get him. Because those guys take four hits with the, uh... Ooh, okay. Four hits with a sword. Oh my god, there's so many places to go. Let's do the secret area first. That felt like more of a reward. <gasps> it was. Oh, it was. What a nice reward. Is this another vitality stone? An ancient shrine offers you a shard of a, uh, from a vitality crystal. You now have three shards. One more will raise your vitality. <sighs> yes. <laughs> Just one more. I bet we're going to find, like, a bunch of other different kinds of stones before we find the last one. But you know what? We'll, we will find it eventually. Okay. So we can go this way. There's also a way on uh, back around at the start of this area that now we can progress to. This lets us use our new ability, though, which is exciting. Okay, so yeah, that was just a little round... roundabout. Now we can go up here. Oh, stretch. This is open. Oh yeah, I don't like those guys. I guess I'm, I feel like each fireball does like one and a half sword hits, I think. About. And I would really like the fire to do double damage. But, you know. Can't ask for too much. That is also 1.5 damage of my current damage, not my original damage. So maybe it's not too bad. Hey, we got it! I found some rogue daggers. I thought it was a cat face. These blades can speedily inflict damage to an opponent. Death by a thousand cuts. Ooh, okay. And can uh, equip it from the weapons menu. Oh, I want to try it. How much does this do? 0.8 damage, but I can do six swings. And my swing time is less. I don't know. If, man. I'll try it, but I kind of feel like anytime we get a new weapon, it's just not as good as our base weapon. I, I don't know. It feels a little lame to say that because I want to try using the different weapons, but I always dislike them. It feels a little bit of a, a missed opportunity. I'll, I'll say, the weapons in this game. Because, like, I at least want whatever I find that's new to be better than what I already have, and it's just that's just very rare to be the case. 
Like, they're super fast, which is nice. Alright, look at me. I'm so speedy. But where do I go from here? Let's upgrade first. Let's get our final magic upgrade. Fifteen. Oh, I have fifteen hundred. It's perfect. I am fully upgraded. More trade off. Yeah. Which, like, I guess if if one is your preferred play style, I can see how there would be like an enormous benefit. But a sword is just like so classically good. Am I... Can I do damage to this? <gasps> I can. I can get through here now. Oh, I'm locked in here. I cannot leave yet. Oh shit, those are spider eggs. Oh, the range is tough. I could- oh, oh, if you stand too close, they wake up. Okay. I was like, I could farm in here. I don't know if that's fun. I don't like this very much. It, it, that feels like just as fast to me, but more powerful and uh, better range. Because you have to dodge out of the way anyways. Like, you can't just button mash the whole time. And I don't want to button mash faster. <laughs> Alright, cool. I think we can leave here. There's so many! Spiders do not like fire. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, I guess we can't go up. Okay, so we'll just go back down. It's fine. Experience. I like the little spiders. Oh my god, there's more though. Maybe I spoke too soon. Like, the spiders are fine, but there's a lot of them. <laughs> I don't mind. That's okay. They're easy. Whoa! I hit so many guys at once, the game just, like, lagged. Like, crazy. Oh, 
Aww. I liked just hitting all of them. Okay, I think I got him. to kill these ones to get through or something? Can I break these? No. What about with this? No. Oh, I get it. I just have to be up here. I get it. It, when it's, like, just barely out of view, I'm like... I'm like, that's rude. That's mean. Yeah, Pyro, you were right. <laughs> you have to light the fire that you can't barely see. those green boys. Oh, big one. Oh, he's got ones on him. This one's got babies. It's a mom. Got the big one. Whew. Sheesh. You're stuck. Sucks. I found an old compass. It occasionally twitches and turns off its on its own whims. It's clearly very old. Perhaps the magnetism inside has mostly worn away. Neat. Okay. We're gonna have to go back around. I get it. I get it. I have to do it quickly. Don't wake up. I guess I do have to wake him up because I need the charges. Yeah, that works. my bow, I guess? Not what I expected to find all the way over here, but I'll do it.
It'll be nice when we find the fire one. Sad that in most games, spiders are enemies. I agree. You said uh, your partner has a tarantula, right? I don't know if I'd, I'd ever keep a tarantula, but I like reptiles a lot. And they also kind of get the short end of the stick. I mean, not as much as tarantulas, but... This guy has, like, very nearly the same Oh, no! The same attack pattern as the other one. Hopefully he won't be too difficult. You really want to keep reptiles once you can afford it? What would you get? What would be your dream reptile? For me, it would probably be a chameleon, but oh lord, they're impossible to keep alive. Ball pythons are also really cute. I loved having geckos. Crested geckos were really good pets. The only problem is that, like, if you want to go away for the weekend, you need to get a pet sitter because of uh, humidity and food. Like, oh, if you give them, you either give them live food uh, or a, this, like, slurry paste, but it dries up overnight. So, like, you have to feed them every day. You can't just leave food out. You want many. <laughs> Doesn't matter what it is. As long as it's cold-blooded. Oh, no. That rotating or orbiting fireball is actually a little challenging to navigate. sucked. Oh, that was brutal. That was a really rough combo. Iguana. Geckos, bearded dragons, maybe a snake. All good picks. Have you ever, um, uh, have you ever seen a Tigu? Those are really cool. They're kind of like iguanas. They're big. But they're, they're really neat and a little bit less common in general. You not? They're neat. <laughs> As I just said, like, 15 seconds ago, but yeah. It's just invincible and missed him for a second. But yeah, chameleons are, are weird because they need really high amounts of airflow. So you need like a, an entirely mesh enclosure for them. But also they need really high humidity. So to get high humidity and high airflow, it's like just really challenging, especially in my climate. 
Um, so they're they're actually illegal in Massachusetts. Uh, but people like go to pet trades in like New Hampshire and then bring them back uh, really commonly. Um, but technically, you're not supposed to have them or buy them, I guess. I don't know if owning them is illegal or buying them in Massachusetts is illegal, but... Yeah, I think it... I don't know. I, I don't know why they're illegal in Massachusetts. I don't know if it has to do with the husbandry or... or what. But they're probably one of those animals that's, like, better not being a pet. were better pets because they're adorable. Oh, he's got two orbiting orbiting things now. God damn it. Oh, uh, my browser crashed. Hold on. Why did my browser crash? Is my stream okay? Looks like my stream's okay. We dropped a couple of frames. I think we're all right. I think we're fine. Just browser was being fussy. That's fine. All right, let's get this guy. Stream is good? Hell yeah. we should upgrade strength to 100%, just like get as powerful as we can, and then we'll work on speed. Oh, damn it. Couldn't get out of the way. See, like, that felt fair. Like, that was just bad luck of where I was standing.
game's a little bit hard to talk while I play because it's so focused. Ooh, get out of the way. Apparently can't be trusted to open containers on your desk. No, you just spilled your drink on your desk. Oh, fuck. That is the worst. I, um... Oh, nice. Nice, we got him. Hell yeah. I have a rule on my desk. So I, I'm not gonna turn my camera because it's a little messy right now and I, I, I don't want to. Uh, but I have a special, like, set. So my, my desktop and... Uh, consoles and stuff are on the uh, my desktop's on the floor but my consoles are on shelving on this side of the desk and then on this side of the desk is any food and drink always completely on the absolute furthest opposite side of the desk um, one time I had a cup of water uh, on the side of my desk that was next to my PC and you can imagine what happened next I will never repeat that mistake Oh, God. I also use more water bottles, like, actually try to, like, have, you know, sealed containers, but that doesn't really work for, like, coffee. But, oh, my God. Yeah, I fried an entire PC. It was awful. It was terrible. It has shaky hands. Oh, yeah, that's rough. It didn't get on anything. Okay, good, good same for drink placement. Yeah, you gotta have a system. You gotta have a system. The silent servant has been vanquished and their soul power added to yours. Holding your arrow spell for longer will now charge your shot and cause more damage. Oh, cool. Maybe I should try using that a little bit more. I've just been using fire. <laughs> it's. I don't know how much damage each thing does, but I guess the, the arrow does more damage now, so... How do I... Oh, I'm out of charges, that's why. I'm like, why can't I attack? This is how I came from. The one downside with that is it doesn't go through them. Like, this one hits multiple things. trying to get a couple of bonus souls while we have like the sheer numbers They're all relatively easy to get got an extra like 20 souls there <laughs> it's something uh and now i'm just trying to find a exit because this is not where i want to be apparently um i might i'm tempted to look up how to get to the entrance of the next area like because it, it must be something that i just missed somehow Maybe I should just, like, go talk to some people or something. Maybe they'll, like, tell me where to go. Doesn't sound like a bad idea. Yeah, like, it's it's nice that I'm getting these, like, this bonus stuff. 
but I want to know where I'm supposed to actually be. Also, how do I leave? I just did this whole loop, but I can't actually go out through the exit. We just need a uh, orc or bridge to pop in. Oh, I don't think I went up this big ladder. This doesn't look familiar. Ah, I didn't. Ah, oh. <laughs> whoops. <laughs> oh. I know where we are. And then over this way, what's this? The summit. Down here is the door. Yeah. Let's, let's do a really quick Google and see if I can find something that'll point me in the right direction. Um, death's door. Uh, third, or no, second? Boss area, maybe? Um, wiki. Oh, that's right. We were like kind of. I think it's the Frog King that we don't have. We start. We saw him. We were like walking around and we saw him, and then I got off track somehow, and I, uh, I missed him. So let me see. Frog King area. Death store. As I don't. The flooded fortress. Run past the entryway that used to retrieve the second soul energy during the mushroom dungeon. I don't know. Oh, I do remember the mushroom dungeon. Okay, so I've done the mushroom dungeon. Okay. Once you're ready, run past the entrance that used to... Re okay. So I want to go back to the mushroom dungeon. Uh, no. Actually, yes, I do want to go here. I do want to go through here. So where the hell was that? Let's check over here. Mushroom dungeon! Yeah, this is where we want to be. 
So, there's a path here that I missed. And it, it got me sidetracked. So let's try to retrace our steps a little bit. I don't think we want to go through there, actually. Unless we do? Because that, that just goes back to the main area, right? Let's just check. It does, yeah. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. That was a test. Uh, this is not the right way. So I'm looking for a sign that says Flooded Fortress. I didn't see one, but I could have gone the wrong way. Just run right past these guys. Don't even need to worry about it. Um... Because I, I don't think it's this way. It's not this way. I think it's like, oh yeah, over here. And then somewhere around here? That's fine. Yeah, here. Not here. That was how we got in. Oh, that was bad damage. Oh, that was worse damage. Oh, don't die. Oh, don't die. Here we go. This way to the Frog King's domain. I'm pretty sure this is where we want to be. Oh yeah, I remember. We came here and we couldn't do anything. Oh my gosh. Captain Clutch, thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing tonight? Welcome in. RS, hello. Vulcan, hello. You failed your emote, so no. <laughs> Miyazaki, welcome in. Oceans1121, welcome in. Cozy Crumbs. How was my day? My day's going pretty well. We're playing some Death Door. Death Door. Pyro, thank you for getting that shout out. What were you playing over there? Playing marbles on stream. Oh, how fun. Cozy, thank you so much for that follow. Ah, uh, no! Oh shit, I died! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> New to you, have you seen this game before? Jay Bigness, thank you for the follow. Vulcan, thank you for the follow. How did I get to where I was? I think it was back this way? Was it? Ocean, RS, thank you for the follows. Uh, no, th this is not right. I went the wrong way. I gotta go back. I gotta go back. Your friend Ginger plays this. Yeah, I'm gonna die a lot. Just so you know, this game is hard. <laughs> 
I really like it though. I highly recommend it. It's kind of like a cross between like Hollow Knight and I I hesitate to say Dark Souls, but it's kind of Dark Soulsy to be honest. Uh, that's what I get for not looking. Get out of my way. Uh, and I want to go down here. We're back on track. We were lost a little bit, but we've figured out how to get where we're going. I should also introduce myself, because we got a lot of new faces here. Um, I'm Ray. I uh, primarily stream a wide variety of indie games. Uh, anything that has a strong narrative or is pretty is super up my alley. Um, and... Uh, that's kind of my deal. I'm looking forward to playing Horizon Forbidden West soon. Um, cause Horizon Zero Dawn's like one of my favorite games, so really looking forward to that. Hello. Check out, um, SIFU. I've seen people play in that. I'm definitely curious. The Crooked Crow doesn't give up easily, huh? You know, out there, I was a tiny frog in a big pond, but here, I'm the top of the food chain. And my favorite meal is all those delicious stray souls. You've got your work cut out for you, Reaper. My subjects will see that. See to that. Then it's crow pie for supper! And a trifle for dessert. Um, our chef makes fantastic trifle. Saint played it last stream, I think. Yeah, I've seen a, a handful of people. Um, a handful of people I follow have been playing it. I, I don't know too much about it. Tough indie game? I mean, that sounds up my alley. It really does. Also, we're finally in, like, all new area of this game tonight, and that feels really nice. Uh, I wonder if I can... I cannot jump to those. Okay. But, um, I hope that you had a lovely stream, Captain. I really appreciate you bringing your people over here. And, uh... I hope y'all enjoy the stream. How do I- how the hell do I progress from here? Um... Ooh. Oh, that was different. Okay. I see the moon's, like, symbol on the ground there, too. I wonder if that's significant in any way. Kevin played Among Us and then Marbles, so it was a lot of fun. Nice. I mean, it's it's hard to go wrong with Marbles on stream. That's always just good vibes. I haven't tried that yet, doing a Marbles stream or, or Jackbox or anything. It, that's way more like hosting rather than just like playing a game and just chilling. Uh... So it's a little bit more daunting for me. Not impossible. But just, just a little more scary. Maybe I should make it a goal. To be something that I... I try to do... In the next couple months. I don't think I can reach that. Oh, I can. I sure can. We'll go up there in a minute. I have a feeling there's going to be a dead end this way that might have something important or a little side item, maybe. Yeah, it's really fun. It's 
it plays very nicely too. I've had a little bit of like audio choppiness. Maybe, maybe I should have gone the other way first. Oh, sh do I go all the way back? I guess so. Fuck. That the forked paths in this game are are tricky. <laughs> like, which one do I think is gonna be uh the main path or not? Like, man. You never know. This, this looks more significant, but it does just have a couple of shortcuts here. The Dirty Tooth, thank you for the follow. Hope you're having a good night. Get out of here. Yeah, get off of my ledge. Oh God, I love these, these secret spots. They're so satisfying. Um, but yeah, I, so this is on Game Pass, and, uh, if you have Game Pass, or you feel like starting, like, a, a free trial of it, I highly recommend checking this game out. Uh, it's definitely worth the $20 that it costs on its own, but, I don't know, I like saving money. <laughs> so I did, like, the three months of, of Game Pass for a dollar, and I have been making a very good use of it. I also just love that I'm an adorable little bird. Like, look, I'm so cute. Look at me. A little lightsaber. Uh, got a little healing seed. If we find anywhere to use that, I would like to. And I have to somehow... I have to somehow activate his mace there. Eh? Yeah! Nice. We'll finish exploring this platform first. You never know what you find. Monsters. You find monsters. Anything else? Okay. Didn't know this is on Game Pass. Need to try it? It was just added. It was just added um, at the start of the month. Any games are sometimes better than, than normal games. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I 100% agree. I think indie games, because they're not being funded by some huge corporation, right, with an agenda, and it's just artists with a passion, they really have way more freedom to just do what they think will make a good game. And I think that's really important. Sometimes... The companies that are out for profit don't make the best decisions when it comes to making games. Who would have thought? Oh my god. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, let's just be careful here. Use a little bit of range. Take them out. Till we get to a healing spot. Oh, I feel a little bad when they're like floating in the water like that. <laughs> It's a little twisted. Um, is there anything over here? There is. I don't think I can get to it, though. I thought I'd be... I guess there is still... some sort of barrier. Oh, did I actually... Yeah, I did hit that. Thank you. Also, do you prefer RS or... Um, how, how do you prefer your name be pronounced? Let me know if, uh, I'm getting it wrong. An intruder. They're intruding. You'll regret this flagnant trespass. You're done for now, little bird. You're gonna get crushed. <laughs> yeah, you wish. You are certainly persistent, crooked crow. Do you like my armor? It was a size too small, but I think I make it work. 
Can you believe I found it just lying around on a nearby corpse? You're just another bleeding, heart standing in the way of progress. This is the natural order. The strong survive. Hop on, small fry. You heard him, hop on. I'm sure I didn't end up between those <laughs> chubby cheeks. Sure hope I don't. That's funny. I do just want to see. Cool. Glad to, glad to know. Thank you for uh, for letting me know. Flooded fortress. Okay. I just wanted to know where that was on the other map so that when I go back, or if I die, I'll, I'll know where I need to be. Ooh. This feels like battle music, but I'm not like fighting anything just yet. Maybe I speak too soon. I bet I speak too soon. It looks like we're about to have some enemies up ahead. think he was going to land on me there. Oh, lots of, lots of bomb paths. Ooh, and a healing spot. That's good. I don't need it just yet, but I might soon. Shortcut ladder. Love it. Anything else back here in the corner? Nope. I'm actually not gonna heal. I'm gonna wait until I have like one or two more damage. these big guys. I do get a lot of Hyper Light Drifter vibes from this game as well. Maybe it's just like, I don't know, it's the combat and the art style. The top-down fighting, the lightsaber. There's a lot of similarities. I feel like this game is pulling a lot of interesting design elements from a lot of different games but it's combining them very well. And I don't know if that's like intentional or not. See, now would be a good time to heal, but I can't go back now. Um, could you say, rephrase that last message? Just so I, uh, I, uh, not entirely sure what you mean. Uh, can't go that way yet. Oh, and that was the shortcut that opened. Nice. So next we go this way. Oh, <laughs> that hat. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. How far back are we? 
Where are we? How do we get to where we were going? This way, okay. At least we'll get some good souls. Oh, and the shortcut's open. So that was actually not a bad place to die. Damn it. He fired faster than I expected him to. I mean, okay, so this has to be, like, reference to Dark Souls, right? With the death, because Dark Souls has a very similar, very iconic death screen. And if, if you're wondering, like, how this, like, compares to other games, um... Hyper Light Drifter does a little bit more of like a 2D version, but it's almost the same top-down kind of stylized view. Um, third person, hack and slash. Line him up. Good thing I deflected his attack. That was tough. Like Minecraft? Uh, not, not so much. Give me this. There we go. All right, we're in a much better position now. Let's see. I don't think we can get across there. Can't really get across there either, so process of elimination. How about here? No. Interesting. Where do we go? I can't hit that from that corner. Um... Oh, we actually, we haven't been this way. I bet it'll take us around. It's kind of got a Diablo kind of feel with puzzles and mobs. Yeah, yeah, I could see Diablo as well. I'm sure you can say that about a lot of games, especially indie games, that they're like, they have a lot of very common themes. So, like, this game does have uniqueness to it, and that shouldn't be ignored either. 
It's just, it's very easy to talk about things in the context of other things. Oh, that destroys the uh, platform that they're on. That's good to know. Why reinvent the wheel if it works? You are not wrong. Why is that not working? It's like hitting something. What if I just come from a different angle? What? Excuse? Excuse me? Oh, okay. So all of those had to be online, maybe? What? there a different way that I can unlock this? The last pad is blocking the shot. I know. And I think I have to go from a different angle to get to it. Maybe. Maybe not. Let me hmm, try going back. Idea. Anytime there's like a suspicious gap in the wall. Why does that not work? Use the hook. Good call. Just be careful about backseating. Um, I do try to do no backseating, uh, and then if I do need help, I will very specifically ask for it. No worries, just for future reference. Decent run until that moment. Pyro, thanks for sharing the rules in the chat. Appreciate it. Appreciate you. Was I going this way? Is this right? No, this is how that's how I got here. Gotta go back. I got this. A map, though. A map in this game would go a long way. Gosh, let people flood in for a second. Lunar, thank you so much for the raid. Appreciate it. Uh, Friday night we were witchering once again. Tootsie rolls. I have Tootsie rolls to drink. Oh gosh, I'm so I might not know the reference. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Forests, thank you for the um, thank you or. Welcome in. Sorry. I, you got a, 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 a first-time chatter, and I, I thought it was a follow. Sorry, I got a little stumbled there. Aaron, the Crystal Claude, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. How... Man, how are you enjoying Witcher, though? Copy-pasted the wrong thing? Okay. Okay, no worries. I was like, that is a random thing to come in with, but, you know, that's fine. 
I got your name right on the first try. Yes, I'm the worst with names. So that is like, it's like a good day. I, that, that made my day good. <laughs> it's so good. That's not what you were playing tonight though, right? You were playing, what is this, balloons? Can you, what is that? Tell, tell me what that is. I'm stuck on a dragon, pretty sure it's the final boss. Oh, damn. Was it good? Was it a good stream, though? Well, you said it's so good, so I, I assume that that was a good stream. <laughs> oh, God, so many projectiles. Get rid of this guy. Ooh. Ooh, these bosses are tough. Or not bosses, these mobs. These mobs are rough. Oh wait, we already did this. Why do we have to do it again? We usually don't have to do all of them again. Oh, okay, you were playing The Witcher and got frustrated, so you played play boots for a bit. Gotcha. It's a tower defense game. You know, it's nice to take those breaks when you need them. Like, my go-to relaxing game is Dorf Romantic. It's like a tile-laying video game with very peaceful music and you just have to, like, match tiles and it's very nice. We wanted Minesweeper. That is not a relaxing game. Minesweeper is not a relaxing game. Also, welcome in B Tactics. Return to Return to Monk. It sounds adorable. I re I like it. I like it a lot. It, I think it's in early access, but it was very good. Yours is is STFU. Yeah. This time you have it ready. Have it installed. Oh, god damn it. I need to, like, clear the enemies before I read chat. But it just, it's, this is a tough game to read chat. Because there's, like, almost always something going on. Okay. We're almost back to where we were. Just kidding, is Hollow Knight? Oh my god. Hollow Knight is hard. I, uh, I never actually finished Hollow Knight. I, um, I got very, very close. Uh, and then I took too long of a break and just never went back and did the final boss because I got, like, a little bit too over it. Um, which is like kind of a bummer. Like, Hollow Knight is such a good game and it deserves for me to finish it. But holy hell, it's just so hard. And I I, I like a challenging game, but. Woo. You have to try Hollow Knight. I mean, it's it's like I, I'd say it's one of the better indie games that exists. Like, it is excellent. But yeah, you have to you have to like a challenge. Oh, oh my god, I'm so glad I didn't fall. Okay, we made it. Made it to where we died. Oh my god. I, I hate these guys. The archers are the worst. Well, oh, nice meeting and seeing y'all at 6 a.m. Seems like a good time to go to sleep. Yes, please get some good sleep. Have a great night. Thank you for the follow and thanks for coming in. Uh, did I play Celeste? I, yeah, I love Celeste. Celeste is awesome. Okay, you're back. Sorry, I had to type to my community and stuff. Thank you so much for the raid! 
Did you have? I, I know you're playing marbles, having a fun community stream, but I you had a, a good time. I assume. I assume it was a good stream. Okay, at least I just healed. Oh, I walked right into that. There we go. I wanted to get at least one of them down before I charged over there. Have a little bit of cover. It was good time. Always good getting to meet new friends and make some new memories. Hell yeah. Sounds like a good night. Yeah, I was saying earlier that I, uh, I am going to go back to that other spot, by the way. I'm just detouring for a second. Um, I've wanted to do, like, marble streams and, and more, like, community-based stuff with, like, Jackbox and things, but... Um, I feel like it's harder to stream because there's less to talk about. Like, here I can talk about the game. There's lots going on that I can speak to. But when it gets to those kind of like community games, it's just a little bit harder. Um, it's something I'd like to get better at. But I, I'm not 100% confident right now with it. A lot harder to stream. You have to bring a good energy for sure. Yeah. And I, I'm also one of those people, I can only stream when I'm in a good mood. So I don't like keep a, a very strict streaming schedule. I usually stream two to three nights per week. But if I'm not feeling it, I just, I just won't stream. Um, because I feel like my energy comes across very obviously. Oh, I'm very low on health. I wish that I could use this again. Do one every Friday. Nice. You'll be back? Sounds good. Any friend of Lunar's is a friend of yours? Aw. Well then, I think you'll fit in quite well here. This is fine. 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 It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Oh my god, I'm so far back. <laughs> Even with the shortcuts, I'm so far back. It's fine, just... There's healing on the way. Just charge through everything. It's fine. I just skip the healing. It doesn't matter. Just run! <laughs> oh, this is a bad idea. Oh my god, there's so many things. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> that was a bad idea. <laughs> Alright, we'll try again. Gotta go to sleep? Well, have a great night. Thank you so much for stopping in. Do I happen to have a game called Valheim? I know about it. I don't have it. You've returned with a snack. What, what snack did you get? Oh, oh, God. What a terrible start. Hookshot, hello. You love Valheim? It's really popular right now. I've seen a lot of people talking about it. Cheese and crackers? Nice. I found a, um, a dairy... This is how I'm gonna die this run, I guess. 
just jumping in the water. This bird cannot swim. Um, I found a, a non-dairy, like, uh, spreadable cheese, like, four crackers, and it's incredible. I ate almost the entire tub in one sitting. It was so good. I had to, like, pull myself away. But they had it at Trader Joe's. Damn it. <laughs> what brand? Um, uh, it was, so it was a brand that makes a regular dairy spreadable cheese. Um, but they had like a, a non-dairy alternative and I, it starts with a B and I, I don't have the name memorized because like I can't have cheese. So it's brand new to me, but other people who are very familiar with cheese can probably name it very easily. Uh, if that helps, it's a common cheese. It's not Brie. It's not like anything like that. Like it's a, it's a brand. At least after all this, we'll be able to upgrade. Food always sounds good. Man, I have been trying to work off that quarantine like 40 and uh, food is always sounding incredible. Like, before I ate because I was bored, and now I eat because, like, dieting is the worst. Not a fan. Don't recommend. Uh, I think I have to go this way, actually. I've used Daya, uh, and one follow your heart before... I one called Follow Your Heart before for pizzas and burgers, vegetarian. I've tried to go vegan cheese. Is your yeah? No, I I totally understand. Um, yeah, Daya is pretty good. Um, it's not good cold though, which is just a bummer. Um, and this one was good cold. I'll have to look it up. It's it's at Trader Joe's though, so I don't know if if you have a local Trader Joe's, but they carry it. Second place? Hello. How are you doing? How was the rest of your stream the other day? Oh, no. Um, there is a healing here. I probably will take it once I get this guy. Yeah, because I was like, I bet I'm going to take one more damage. Okay, we're in a good spot. We're in a good spot. We've got one more little, like, bossy area right here. This guy. Oh, shit. It's a bad combo. Got him. Nice. I got another PB. Ended up with 19.15. Hell yeah. That's awesome. Congratulations. Speedrunning is like... Something that I... I seriously appreciate. Seriously appreciate. I have no idea how you have the mental capacity to speed run like that would actually drive me insane um um get rid of the that guy first it's the worst Oh, 
Oh, I thought I died. No, 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 no. <gasps> Shit, fuck. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. A magical quest starring Mickey Mouse. Yeah, that's right. Oh my gosh. What a what a game. Actually, I am going to be playing a retro game. Um uh, uh or at least I don't know if it counts as retro, but um either for my stream anniversary, which is coming up in March, or um Uh, oops. For my birthday stream, which is in April, uh, I'm going to play Croc Legend of the Gobos. I have decided. I'm very excited because that was like my first video game ever. That's what started all of this madness. Never played it, but you know it's good. I have no idea if it holds up. No idea whatsoever. But I loved it. It was it was like my favorite thing as a kid. Shit. This area is hard. <laughs> For the record, this is a tough area. Super Mario Bros. was your first? That's a classic. Oh my gosh. On uh, Game Boy? Man, soon I should maybe go through the door and just level up. Yeah, I've got enough enough for it. SNES, gotcha. It's funny, I have no idea how old I was when the Game Boy the Game Boy Color was my first console, technically. Uh aside from like PC, I guess. Because I think I think PC games were around a little, like, mainstream a little bit before. But, um... I remember when I got it. And I remember playing the, the Croc portable Game Boy Color game. And, uh... My parents were just like, oh my god, she's gonna be occupied for years. What a blessing. So SNES, when did SNES come out? Because I, I feel like I remember that being around. Like, I didn't get into gaming until a little bit later. Oh, I need to heal up before this fight. There we go. Okay, that'll do. Uh. Not bad. 1990, yeah. Okay, that sounds right. Get me out of here. 
Oh, cool. We can, like, pair these guys off. That's nice. Little, little cheesy. But you know what? We were just talking about, about some cheese. What other systems did I have? I had the... I, I didn't get the PlayStation 1, but I did get the PlayStation 2. A lot of my friends had the, the earlier Nintendo consoles, though. But I, I never really played Nintendo games. It's kind of new for me. Now that I have a Switch, um... I'm actually playing, like, Zelda for the first time. Breath of the Wild was my very first Zelda game. Ooh, that's fine, that's fine. Let's get that planted so that it'll be there when I need it. Fuck. Alright, I need it now. Oh my god, there's so many guys. Shit! <laughs> Not the best one to start with. Fair enough. Oh my god, I Ah, uh, god. This, this is hard. This is a little bit punishing. This is a little bit harder than I'd like. It's fine. Oh my god. Just restart. What a bad start. Uh, yeah, we want to go this way. It's like, if you can just run through them, you really don't need to fight everything. But if they all, like, follow and team up like that, it's suddenly much more difficult. Like, I didn't think that they were going to follow me this far. It's the Amiga. What? That doesn't even sound familiar to me for some reason. God damn it. Oh, god damn it. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> Is there like a healing thing around here somewhere? There's lots in these other areas. Oh, no. No. Nah. -uh. No, thank you. This guy, he's not going anywhere. Ooh, that almost got me. All right, got the tough one.
Perfect. As long as that guy doesn't bother me. Oh, and then there's health up here. <gasps> Shit. I didn't think he'd be able to get up. No, I just healed. Get out of here, man. Not cool. Not cool. Also, hey, British. I don't know if I said hi when you came in. How are you doing? I thought I'd dodge that. Shit. Okay, heal. Got him. Alright, we just have to keep our distance. These guys aren't that hard. They just move around a lot. Gotta watch where they're going. Keep ahead of them. Try to get the little guys. The, Cause this this guy's the worst. No fucking hell. No shit. That was the worst spawn. I blame the spawn. I I guess for some reason I didn't take damage, so I thought I was dead. That was even worse. That was my fault. I just wasn't looking at the screen. I'm starting to get mad. <laughs> this is fine. This is fine. Does anyone have any fun weekend plans that you're excited to talk about? Have too much, but I am looking forward to D&D &D tomorrow. I found out that, uh, I thought that we were canceling this weekend, but it's actually next weekend. Because I am... I always... I don't know if anyone else is like this, but I always get confused when someone says this weekend or next weekend. I always just assume it's the upcoming weekend. That's usually incorrect. Ignore that one. Go straight to killing that guy. Oh, that's okay. One damage is fine. I will get to the next save area tonight. I refuse to... not get through this. I am way too stubborn. So we've gotten this. I am gonna si I am gonna consume that. It's only one health, but we need it for this area. No shit. God. The uh 
the bridges are something else. There we go. Not bad. Get a couple of mushrooms. Oh. Uh, oh shit. Okay. Fuck. Oh, I thought that got me. All right, we're still in it. We're still in it. I'm out of charge. It's fine. I don't know if this is the final wave. I kind of suspect there's going to be one more. Oh, maybe not. Oh my god, yes. Oh god, yes. Yes, 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 yes. How do... What? How do I get back? What? No way. They wouldn't make it so that, like, you have to fall in the water. That's weird. That can't be intentional. There must be a way to get across using these. But uh, I can't figure it out. I don't know. I'm, I, I'm sure it'll become clear later. Or maybe it was just a mean puzzle where you have to finish with at least one <laughs> extra health, at least two health. Yes! All right, we got a new save door. We earned this. We earned this. Let's get some combat abilities. Dexterity would be nice. Strength would just be nice to get extra. We can get two. I am still kind of thinking that the better to get a track like fully upgraded before doing another one, but I think I want I think I want haste. And strength. I think these are both really solid. Hard to go wrong. I'm sure we'll end up buying everything eventually. Bridge, welcome back. Yeah, we got we got some very kind raids and it was very good fun. Also, I figured it out. I found the uh, the Frog King and by figure it out, I mean I looked it up because I was not sure where to go. I didn't know where I messed up at one point and got on the wrong path and I could not for the life of me figure out how to get back to where I was. Oh, and I, I guess I guess we're at a boss again. This is your favorite boss? Nice. I'm glad that the timing worked out. Clearly my grunts have failed to teach you a lesson, so I'll have to do it myself. After I'm done with you, I'll use your feathers to buff my armor and make it all shiny. I'll be the most handsome creature under the shadow of the door. All right. Squishy time. The king of the swamp. Oh, let's get him. Lord of his domain, ruler of all these sur surveys, champion of the people, keeper of the <laughs> five oaths, first of his- <laughs> Oh, I, I didn't mean to do that, but that's fine.
This feels very different from the last ones. I can see why you like it. But we'll see what his combos are like. I can't really tell if I'm doing damage to him. I assume I am. Oh, I, I have to hit him in the back. Okay, I get it. I get it. His armor is protecting him. I have to hit him in the back. Freaky. Oh no. Oh. I'm going to die like that a lot. Yeah, okay. I guess I'm guessing I have to hit his uh his mace, too. In order to, like, fill the tiles back in or something. I almost wonder if this would be better in this area. For now. Yeah, just to get over to him. Okay, now we'll switch to this. I guess it's not doing anything when I do hit him in the back, so. At least for, like, filling out <laughs> this area. For safe places to walk. Wow. Okay, this is tricky. bugged out a little bit. There's gotta be a way to fill in the tiles. There's gotta be. There's gotta be a way. I'll try the, the hook. I'll try using the hook. I will preemptively grab the hook. Come at me, man. Bridge, I hope you're having a good night. Come on. Uh, missed. So, funny story. I pre-ordered, um... Uh... I pre-ordered, uh, Horizon Forbidden West. And Amazon said it wasn't going to ship until uh, next week. 
And I was like, I don't want to wait a whole week. Uh, so I just drove over to Target and just... Oh shit, that didn't work. There's gotta be a way to fill in... The tiles, though, because there's, like, nowhere to stand. Night has been good. Playing up some Dying Light 2 with the homies? Hell yeah. You too? It's not coming till Tuesday. You can wait, got other games. Yeah, the only game on my plate right now is this one. As soon as I finish this game, I'm gonna start Horizon. Um, I was debating actually playing it on stream because I was like, I know I'm just gonna want to pour hours into this. Uh, oh, that's right. I gotta get behind him. But I think it would be fun to stream it in some way. I don't know. I don't know if I'll do like the whole game on stream or just like a portion of it or something. I don't know. We'll, we'll figure it out. We lost power early day, but it came back. I'm glad that it came back pretty quick. Why doesn't that work? That should work. I don't know why that doesn't work. Maybe I just have to be very selective about which tiles get broken. Like, here, I'm screwed. Horizon's game, you probably won't stream to see you. I guess you'll have no life. Yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah, no, I, I totally understand. I, I've done that for a couple games where, like, I'll stream the beginning of it and then play the rest of it off stream. I actually did that for Spirit Fair because I didn't realize how fucking long that game is. It is so long. It's excellent. Don't get me wrong. Spirit Fair is an excellent game, but it is so long. Have the same feeling about Breath of the Wild that you have about Horizon. You want to stream the main story, but there's such long games that you'll probably do a lot of the exploration and grinding off stream. Yeah, I'm thinking something similar. Be too into the story, wouldn't want to wait for stream to keep going. Yes, that's the other thing. Like, I don't have the energy to stream every day, but I have the energy to play games every day. Fuck. Did I fall? Shit.
shield. Okay. Bridge, am I right that there is a way to uh, activate those platforms again? I need confirmation on that. Because there, I feel like there must be, and I should focus on trying to figure out how to do it. I am right, okay. But the grapple didn't work. The fire didn't work. The mace is critical. go. I hit it with the arrow. Okay. Oh, don't fall, don't fall. Oh, it's fine. I feel like more stuff than just the arrow should set it off. Like, if I hit him with a bomb, I think that should work, but that's just me. damage I'm taking is just from falling in the water, I think. going with red mace, red bow. I, yeah, I guess. Yeah, it makes sense. I don't like it, but it makes sense. Oh, shit. I got him. That wasn't too bad. It was way easier than Betty. That's two down. Hell yeah. We gather here today to mourn the passing of the Frog King, a bold and fearless leader. He was persecuted for his simple desire to place all in the forest under his rule, and occasionally his bottom. His reign is ended, and his absence will be felt across the swamp. Bow your head in remembrance, pay your last respects. His time in this world is over. Rip. F. Is there an F button on my controller? Some will be pleased the king is dead, but a life is a life, and in death we are all unified. Thanks for the soul for- whoa! Whoa! Did you see that? His eye opens when I go up the ladder. He's not dead. He's alive. It's gonna be okay. Someone, someone call a nurse. <laughs> ready, 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 ready. 
<laughs> oh, that's goofy. What a silly bug. What's this? You found a giant arrowhead. I wouldn't want to be on the receiving end of one of those. Neat. Well, I, I like, I, yeah, I, I guess I just got lucky spotting it. Is there anything else to do in here? It doesn't look like it, which is kind of surprising. Usually there's always a path to follow. But I guess we have the, uh, the, uh, soul now so we can go back. Orc, hello. How are you doing? Are you streaming tonight? Nope. Oh, okay. I thought that I, I saw you uh, playing something on Discord and I assumed that you were like getting ready to, to stream it, but I, I was wrong, clearly. Welcome to the Soul Vault. Would you like to increase your combat abilities? Uh, no, I don't have enough money. What time is it? I'm gonna have a quick BRB. I wanna keep playing. I think I'm gonna keep playing, but I have to go stir my chili. So, I will be right back. Well, actually, now that I think about it, now that I think about it, wasn't in the mood my tomorrow, fair enough. Um, we just finished the the boss there. We've already done everything up to the boss for Betty. And then I assume that we're getting close to the end of the game once we have that last uh, soul. And once, if that is just like the end of the game, you know, in terms of like there's less than an hour left, uh, I could do some like extra con- extra- extra content. I could do some extra, uh, digging around the rest of the game and like find the secrets, get these crystal shards that I missed. Um, what do you say, uh, Bridge and Orc? You've both played this. Um, if I've gotten these two bosses, do I have more than three hours of gameplay remaining? I- I highly doubt it. I bet it's like an hour. out of curiosity because I might save it for tomorrow and do another stream tomorrow if we still have a lot left then I'll, I'll play but I have a feeling we don't more than three if you're going collectible hunting at least three hours okay Okay, all right, well, uh, hmm. Should we go try to kill Betty, then? Where is Betty? Yeah, good night, Seamus, if you're taking off. Have a good night. Where the heck are, are Betty's doors? I think they're down here. It's not any of these, right? Nope. That's the... I think it's down. An hour or two if I don't go collectible hunting? Okay. I won't do, like, heavy collectible hunting. I just might do a little bit. The old watchtower. Camp the Crows. Strand Sailor. Castle. Betty's Lair. I think I'm gonna go here, and then I'm gonna raid. It is late. It is past midnight, and I usually not stream in this late. Okay. And we just saved. All right, so I am in a raid. If you stick around for the raid, you'll get bonus channel points, which you can uh, use to make me uh, give cats treats and um, uh, future game selections. I'm going to be mixing up getting over it soon. That's, I feel like, less exciting. People aren't super jived about getting over it at this point, so we'll put something else in there, some other kind of goofy thing that people can vote on. Uh, or even I'll make that a, uh, just like a, a redeem where anything in my library, so you can vote for me to play. I want to incorporate something like that a little bit more um, when I'm like in between games. Um, but yeah, so you get those extra channel points. I also want to thank Lunar and Captain for those raids. Really, really appreciate it. Thank you for bringing your communities over here. And thank you for everyone who followed. Um, that actually pushed us up to 
uh, nearly 250 followers. So I am really excited about that. And thank you. Um, but let's see who's online and we can send the love over to another lovely person. Let's see. <laughs> 